everybody. All right, I'm doing something a little bit different today. Um, I know I haven't put out a video in a long time. I actually have to refilm one of my videos. It's going to be a bullet journal update, but uh, for some reason the camera was, it's like flipped, so if every time you try to like look at it the right way, it flips automatically, so I have to refilm that. Um, but I've got a little bit of time before I head to work. I'm sitting in a parking lot right now um, on this rainy, rainy Seattle day, and I thought I would give you a quick update about what's going on. I know I haven't put out a lot of videos lately, um, but I've just been really, really busy. So, um, just a couple things that I wanted to address um, because I know I haven't gotten back to YouTube videos, comments either. Um, but I remember a couple questions that people have commented um, and I will address them here and then I will try to scroll through some of the comments to see if there are other like Q&A's kind of things that I could do in these like quick updates. Um, but somebody had asked me if I'm still crafting. Um, yes, but I'm just not making junk journals. Um, I just don't see the need to make junk journals when I'm not really using them. I'm still on my like goal to use up a lot of notebooks and things and so uh, just because I want to make a junk journal doesn't mean I have to because I know I'm just not gonna get to it um, and I think later on I will get back to making junk journals it's just that right now I just don't want to keep buying supplies I don't want and I don't have a lot of supplies to make junk journals anymore. I got rid of a lot of that stuff. Um, and <clears throat> I know you could say, yes, well, you could give it away or you could sell it. I don't have time to post it to sell it. And, um, I don't have any friends who are into, um, junk journals. And right now it's just not within my budget to like mail things out. If I just like, you know, give away those things. Um, because, and I'll address this later in my stationary minimalism update just because uh, this year my budget has changed a little bit and so I'm just not going to have like limitless money to just spend on craft supplies and journaling. So that's just the reality of things. I know a lot of people don't like to talk about that, the crafting side of like budgeting and money and spending. Um, but whatever, this is real life. I don't... <laughs> I just don't have the money to keep buying and trying and, and hoarding. I just, um, I just don't. Um, if I'm looking down at, I'm looking down at my notes. Um, somebody commented about linking, like, things that I mentioned in my videos, um, which is a good tip. I did that once long, long time ago, and I think maybe it's because I was in the beginning of my YouTube channel that nobody was really clicking on it. And I appreciate the tip because I have thought about that for a while lately, um, just because I do get a lot of comments asking where I've gotten things. Um, I don't know how I feel about affiliate links. I mean, that's really cool if you guys want to like click on my link and, you know, I get a little something, you get a little something. But, um, it just, it takes a long time to do that. And I just don't have that time to spend on the computer linking things because linking things takes a long time and I can't even get back to YouTube comments right now so um, that is something that I plan to do in the future and thank you for that uh, reminder because like I said I have thought about that in long uh, for a while so and I appreciate that you guys want to uh, would be willing to click on my link if I provided that so that will be in the works um, just not right now. Also because I also, I just don't have like a good working laptop to do all of that. I'm doing most of my stuff on my phone, which is also very slow and kind of crappy. So, um, but just wanted to give you a heads up about that. So yes, thank you for the reminder. Um, I am so thankful for you guys. I, you guys are just you guys create such a great community, and I am so grateful for that. Um, all your lovely comments addressing my anxiety and my depression, and what I've shared so far, and I just, you guys are the best. I am so happy to be a part of this journaling community, and 
that in itself makes me want to share more and more. Um, and that's one of the main reasons why I keep coming back. Um, because social media in general is a very overwhelming place because you can be judged by whatever you share, whether it's positive or negative, people are always going to be judging you. And I am very lucky so far, I haven't gotten a lot of negative comments. Um, that's not to say that I haven't at all, but I've been able to brush a lot of the things that I have gotten off. Um, but at the same time, you hear those horror stories, and sometimes it's just anytime I get like a little, like, you've got a comment or you've got a direct message, I feel this like inner cringe kind of feeling like, oh my god, this is going to be the moment where somebody just blows up and just rants about me or whatever I'm doing. Um, but so far I haven't. I'm so thankful. Thank you guys so much for your lovely comments. Um, you guys are just the best and I love sharing with you guys. So um, thank you for that. And I just wanted to give you an update about my journal. I've moved back into my Olive uh, Traveler's Notebook. Um, lovely scratched up. I love it. Um, and nothing has really changed with the setup. Um, but what I have noticed since it turned the new year, I think it started this on January 30th, so right before the new year, I have not been journaling that much. I think at most I've been writing maybe like a couple paragraphs in the morning if I get a chance right before work, but I don't find myself grabbing for it right after work and just writing, writing, writing like I used to, like I did last year. Uh, a lot of it has been, I've just been busy or I just haven't felt the need to journal, which I find very odd because I spent all of last year just living with my thoughts and my pages. And this year, something has switched. I don't know what, um, but maybe just priorities have changed and I've just had to spend more time on other things um, other than just journaling. So I'm still enjoying the Traveler's Notebook. I love it. I am in my number 13 insert, which is a really nice feeling. Um, the sad part is I haven't been able to use a lot of pencil with it just because it doesn't take pencil very well. I think it's just because it's such smooth paper. It's not very toothy. It doesn't take the nice soft graphite that I really like. But um, so today is February 8th. I think I'll post this tonight or tomorrow. So yeah, I've not, I've only s filled out maybe like 10, 15 pages. I haven't really journaled a lot, guys. Um, so I, I wonder if that, like people go in phases. Is that like a thing? Like, do you guys find yourself journaling a lot and then all of a sudden you just don't even want to look at it? Um, maybe that's a thing. I, I mean, you know, people get busy, you're just tired, you just want to do other things. Um, so that's my journal update so far. Um, I am, I think I mentioned that in the beginning of the video that I will be posting a bullet journal update once I can get the camera to like face the right way. And uh, so far I'm really, really liking it. I actually have all my notes for like my video right in here. I have so many videos I want to do for you guys. It's just that I haven't had time to just sit down and do it. I've got like a journal tag that I was tagged on a uh, video. I want to do my stationary minimalism update because I've gotten a lot of comments about that in a recent Instagram photo. And so uh, look out for all of that and junk journal shares. That's a big one. I know I've uh, mentioned that. But um, all right, it's uh, I got to get to work soon. But real quick, um, because I don't post a lot, you can find me on Instagram if you want to follow me there. I post there pretty much every other day, if not every day. And so out of all the social media, that's where you can find me. I'm at girl and quill um, and spelled out all the way. Um, so if you uh, want to just keep up to date with what I'm up to, uh, that's where you can find me. So I hope you guys are doing well. I hope you are enjoying your journals so far this year or your bullet journals or your planning and I will catch up with you guys later. Bye!